hello and welcome to our channel Flex Sumro. As you know that we are making the videos on the Android application development. So this is our second video on this channel. In this video we will create our first application program as you can say the hello world program and some information which is very important to learn for you as we will start our android studio you will see this screen now first of all we will click on the new project these are some activities on which we can create the application you can see here the types of activities no activity basic activities bottom navigation activities and others i will make a separate video on these activities and will brief you what uh, are the functions of all these activities one by one at this stage we will use this empty activity i am selecting this empty activity and will press the next button here are some options which we have to complete first of all the a name of the project empty activity create a new empty activity now here I will name my project my first Android app now you can see here the package name net.ilmiroshni.myfirstandroidapp this is the package name of my application it depends upon my domain name as you already know that we have our website ilmiroshni.net so we have given or set our package name as net.ilmiroshni and dot after the name of our project is already written here after that this is the save location it's asking that where do you want to make or save your project now I have selected the D uh, folder or drive in which I have already created my first Android app uh, let me to check I will select the folder here are the Android app projects I had made it's saying that uh, Android app projects already exists at the specified uh, project location and it is not empty so I will make it unique by pressing one okay now here it's asking that in which language you are making your android application i am selecting here the java we can also select the kotlin language which is the official language of android by the google we will also make the projects in the kotlin language but first of all we have to learn the kotlin so in future we will also see this kotlin but now we will select the Java language as our uh, programming language now minimum SDK these are the API and Android operating systems it's uh, saying that your app will run on approximately 98% of all the devices we should try to select that API which can be run on approximately all the devices so I will select another device uh, suppose I select here the API 16 which says that 100% the devices will be run if you select this uh, minimum ST I'll click on the finish button now you can see here it's uh, making important settings and downloading the important uh, necessary files it depends upon the speed and computer and uh, internet speeds now it has created all the necessary settings 
and it's finished now now you can see here in this environment that this is the file manager from where we will operate or handle our projects we can make the new projects we will open uh, our already saved projects from here we can uh, close the projects and uh, other necessary settings and some other information which we will learn in future and all these menus would be discussed in upcoming videos after that and this is the navi navigation bar or toolbar we can say now this is the android is already selected in which java uh, folder is already selected from where we will uh, create our project as you can see here the main activity is already selected here you will see the two main files one is activity underscore main dot xml file this is the physical and uh, forms and views we can see here i am minimizing the size of this form and if we click on this main activity dot java file this is our section where we will uh, code our program our application our project in the main activity xml file we will place the text views buttons image views recycler views fragment components and uh, all these components and uh, uh, tools we will create from here and you can see also here the two options of uh, design and code if i am selecting this xml file and press the code you can see here that text view uh, has been selected i am showing you this is the text view this is text view which is already designed from this design view mode if we will design our code we can also uh, design by the coding in this way which we will discuss in the future upcoming videos now this is our hello world text view file in the right section you are looking here the attributes these are the properties window this is the properties window where from we can handle all our uh, views suppose this is the hello world and if i want to increase the size of this hello world i will find it here the size of the text now you can see here the size of the text is already we have found here now i will increase the size of the text from here now you can see here the hello world is now visible and increased uh, the size and suppose i am changing its color now the text color i am giving here from the text color from this section you are looking the color has been changed now i want to see the result in my avd android virtual device this is our android virtual device now i am going to show this device i am clicking on this play button to show our android virtual virtual device which is emulator this is just like our cell phone or android phone visible on our screen now you can see the emulator has been loaded our project has been appeared hello world now we are looking our result of hello world so this was our first android application program which we have created in this uh, program now if you liked our this program subscribe our channel like our videos and share it to your friends so we will meet in next video so see you